Hey guys, this is a PC Tech Crew, and today I'll be showing you how to download and put a ROM on your SD card of your Android phone or a Windows phone. Okay, first step is now to go to the internet. Alright, once that's loaded, go to the top bar and type in www xda-developers.com press enter and you'll get this now all you gotta do is go to uh... once it's done go to click on forums and you should get this okay now all you gotta do is um... scroll down and there is every phone that they hold which is Look at that sidebar. A long list of phones. So, all I gotta do is now is just find my phone, which is the uh, Evo 3D. It's pretty far down. It's almost here and right here here we go HTC Evo 3D and I am on CDMA because I am on Sprint and here we go look at all these ROMs kernel alright now we will which one should I get uh... I'll try this one Alright, now this is the ROM I'm going to get. Scroll down, it shows you all the features, screenshots, what's new. Okay, the instructions. I know how to do it all, but okay. Now all you want to do is, there it is, links to download. Click on the link. And there you go, you get all these options. I am going to pick uh do multi upload since it's a uh, direct download there we go no I'm not okay we're going I'll do mega upload much faster just gotta wait a couple seconds this, this ROM is pretty big okay regular download just brought up an ad Okay, right here, here it is, much faster. Alright, uh, alright, I will come back to the video when it's done downloading. Alright, the ROM is about to finish in six seconds, five. You can see there's not that much left, and we are done downloading that so what we're going to do is click on that little arrow if you're running chrome or just go to the folder where you know it downloaded to and there it is right there we can X off the internet we don't need that anymore let's make that half screen and there it is now I'll go to my android phone my evil 3d and I'll show you how to mount your phone as a disk drive so you can drag it over to your root of your card Alrighty, and now we're on my home screen, and all you have to do is just plug our phone in, or my phone in, there it is, and I'll just click on the little thing that looks like a card, I can't do that because else my video will stop, but that's what you gotta do, just click the second tile, and if, that, if you don't get that when it comes up, all you gotta do is drag down the menu, and click on the charge only, and then click the thing, yeah, and I'll meet you back at my desktop. Alright, we are now back at the PC. And, um, if you plug in your phone and you do the steps I showed you, you should get this little box. And if you do get it, just press uh, this, open folder view, and this is everything that's on my SD card. 
Now, if that didn't come up for you, all you got to do is go down to your start menu and go to computer. And then it should be under devices with removable storage and it's this one. Just click on that and it'll bring you to this. Okay, now what we're going to do is we're going to take this ROM and just simply drag it over and it's going it's going to copy over there are certain there's different steps to actually flashing this ROM I'm not going to show you how to do that it's just it's just me actually uh, just putting it on the card so after this is done yeah waiting for it to finish downloading or moving <clears throat> but yeah that's basically about it you might as well just stop the video now but yeah, this is it's just going to be this for the rest of the time. And remember, it's really easy to do. You have to be rooted and S off in order to flash these ROMs. Alright, and it is about to finish. About five seconds, and we are done. And it is now on the root of my SD card. Alright. Thank you for watching, and see you in the next tutorial.